Welcome, and thank you for joining us for today's encouragement from Our Daily Bread on the 26th of April 2024. The Bible reading today is Philippians chapter 4, verses 14 to 20. Yet it was good of you to share in my troubles. Moreover, as you Philippians know, in the early days of your acquaintance with the gospel, when I set out from Macedonia, not one church shared with me in the matter of giving and receiving, except you only. For even when I was in Thessalonica, you sent me aid more than once when I was in need. Not that I desire your gifts. What I desire is that more be credited to your account. I have received full payment and have more than enough. I am amply supplied. Now that I have received from Epaphroditus the gifts you sent, they are a fragrant offering, an acceptable sacrifice pleasing to God. And my God will meet all your needs according to the riches of his glory in Christ Jesus. To our God and Father be glory for ever and ever. Amen. Today's article, titled Serving Together in Jesus, was written by Jennifer Benson Schult. Rescue workers cooperated to help two men stranded on an island in Micronesia. Teamwork was necessary because a widespread health crisis required them to limit their exposure to each other. The pilot who first spotted the castaways radioed a nearby Australian Navy ship. The ship sent two helicopters which provided food, water and medical care. Later the Coast Guard arrived to check on the men and deliver a radio. Finally, a Micronesian patrol boat taxied them to their destination. We can accomplish a lot when we work together. The Philippian believers pooled their efforts to support the Apostle Paul. Lydia and her family welcomed him into their home. Clement and even Euodia and Sintichi, who didn't get along, all worked directly with the Apostle to spread the good news. Later, when Paul was imprisoned in Rome, the church gathered essentials for a care package and delivered it via Epaphroditus. Perhaps most importantly, the Philippians prayed for him throughout his ministry. The examples of believers serving together in this ancient church can inspire us today, cooperating with fellow believers to pray and serve others as God leads and empowers us accomplishes much more than we could ever do on our own. It has been said, individually, we are one drop. Together, we are an ocean. Let's pray. Dear God, please show me how to join with others who are serving you. Amen. Thanks for listening today. My name is Naomi. And today's encouragement was provided by Our Daily Bread Ministries.